Welcome everyone. Did you know that there's four different lion tamarins, and they all can only be found in one place, which is the Brazilian rainforest? Today we'll be focusing on the golden-headed tamarin. Well, here are the other three tamarins: the golden lion tamarin. We have covered the golden lion tamarin in a previous video, uh, named the golden lion tamarin. They are the cutest primate, which I'll link in the description if you'd like to check it out after this one. The other two members of the group are the Black Lion Tamarin, also known as the Golden Rump Tamarin, and the Black Face Tamarin. But back to today's video on the Golden Headed Tamarin. Named for their thick, long golden mane, the Golden Headed Lion Tamarins, like many Tamarin species, are tree dwelling, fruit eating primates. The Golden Headed Lion Tamarin sadly is an endangered species, but we'll get into that in a minute. Fun fact, these little guys can actually climb down from the top of the canopy, face down along trees or backwards. They also play a significant role in seed dispersal. Many of the fruits that they eat, their seeds pass through the monkey's digestive tract unharmed and ended up being deposited well away from the parent plant. Recent research within the last couple of years suggests that the seeds may also help to dislodge intestinal parasites in the monkey's digestive tract. These little monkeys spend about 25 to 25% of the time foraging for food. They will be classed as frugivorous, eating mostly soft, sweet fruits. They will also eat flowers, nectar, insects, and small invertebrates. Sometimes they will eat the gum, which is exuded from the wounds in the cashew tree. They do not eat leaves. Like most tamarins, these little guys normally give birth once a year to twins during the warm and wet season from September to March. The gestation period lasts about 125 to 132 days, but males and females can invest energy into caring for the young. All members of the group also help with juvenile care. Males of this species usually become reproductively mature at around 24 months of age or two years and females are about 18 months. Currently in Brazil, there's an estimated 6,000 individuals living in the wild, all living in the UNO Biological Reserve, which was created back in the 1980s to help the golden lion tamarin survive. The main threat for these guys is habitat destruction, as there's not much of their original home left in Brazil, as the Brazilian rainforest is getting cut down. Folks, if you like this video, you might like Google's next recommendation on the golden lion tamarin. Please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you in the next